Hey guys, I'm currently rounding up my three favourite Photoshop plugins and this is my third and final one of the series. Uh, today we're going to be looking at CSS Free PS. CSS Free PS has got to be one of my all-time favourite plugins, uh, particularly uh, doing a lot of web applications recently. This has just proven completely and utterly indispensable to my workflow. Um, and again, it's completely free. Um, CSS Free PS, what it does is it dives into your document, um, it looks for every single element which has got a blending options uh, set to it or kind of layer style set to it uh, and it will turn that into workable CSS free which you can then drag and drop into your code um, and you've got the exact look from Photoshop straight into workable code just like that it's crazy it's, it's exactly kind of like the uh, sketch feature which um, which is really again really really versatile but again it's completely free you don't have to worry about downloading any specific uh, software just this plugin and it does such a fantastic job I'm going to show you exactly how it works right now uh, with this excellent button here so let's ditch our hover style and um, as you can see on our normal button here we actually have on this kind of rounded rectangle we have an inner shadow which is giving us this sort of beveled effect. Uh, we've got this inner glow, which adds a bit of contrast between the background and the foreground. We've got a gradient to give it a bit more 3D. Uh, we've got an outer glow, and then we've actually got the drop shadow to it, which kind of, you know, really, really makes it look like a button. Um, separately, this would take absolutely ages for me to put in. I'd have to worry about putting separate sort of borders on, then separate drop shadows, then a gradient over the top of it. It would take absolutely ages. Completely possible, but again, if it, CSS free PS is an absolute time saver. Um, what it does is, again, just like all the other plugins that we've gone through today, is it uh, sits in your little kind of uh, plugins window just right here. Uh, when you click on it, there aren't any options or anything. It is as simple as it is literally as simple as this. All you have to do is get everything sorted, get it looking as you want to, and then click on the massive CSS free PS button. And what that does is it actually takes you into your browser um, and then it presents you with the rounded rectangle and every single kind of uh, property to go with it. So as you can see, it's actually figured out the width, the height, um, and all of the, bo the border radius, so the kind of rounded edges around it. And then it, it sorts out all the box shadows and everything else, basically. You don't have to worry about any of it. So to demonstrate the power of this, um, I've actually fired, I've got a uh, kind of a document already for you, just an HTML, plain HTML file. Uh, we've got the background set as it was beforehand, and we've just got a plain unstyled box. So if I jump into my code now, um, what we've got is we've got my button, which again is 250 pixels wide, 100 pixels high, um, and our background color is white. However, we don't want that. We want it to look like our Photoshop mockup. So let's grab the styles from uh, CSS Free PS. I am going to go ahead and I'm going to grab uh, just the ones that I want specifically to this. So I want to keep the width and the height the same and I want to keep it centered um, But I want these kind of rounded edges and the fancy box shadows and everything So I'm going to copy and paste that into here, which is going to replace my background color uh, So if I paste that into there hit save, yes, that's a lot of values, but <laughs> It does the job. Um, and then if I hit refresh, as you can see, we have our perfect button with everything in there. You've got the gradient, you've got the uh, little kind of outer shadow, which I put on to add the contrast. You've got this little top area with all of the uh, kind of, uh, what's it called, the transparency on top of that as well. It literally remembers everything. And it looks stellar, you know, it looks absolutely excellent.